on the streets of Hollywood. Shameful. Not that the person, you know, they have their own life choices. What's shameful is that this city is just not willing to clean up these encampments. People aching. This is Hollywood. I'm about to reach Hollywood Boulevard. If you were thinking of visiting Hollywood Boulevard, would you imagine this? That's not what you see in the movies, right? That's not what's going on. You see in a different picture of what's really going on here in Hollywood. Homelessness. If I ever attain any sort of status, I never want to star on Hollywood's boardwalk. Why? Or on Hollywood Boulevard? Why? Because why would I want my name shining brightly for people to step on while there are people next to these monikers of status of wealth sleeping on the streets because our country has failed. We haven't failed to produce massive amounts of new technologies, money, economy, so on, but we have failed our people. There's the encampment there. Shameful. I'm headed right to Hollywood Boulevard. Let's see what else we can find. I'll make this a full length video, a full journalistic nothing I can do but do something about it reach to your congress member reach to your representative say something do something if you're not from California I hope you're fixing what's on your neighborhood I heard it's even worse in San Francisco I feel okay and safe to walk the streets even though I look like I have some status or I got a collar so on I don't believe I'm gonna get mugged out of nowhere that's why I'm avoiding Skid Row. I know these places. I'm not going near Skid Row. I wouldn't last there. No Compton, none of that. This is Hollywood. The Hollywood stars. And yet, look at this, look at this. Filth, trash, decay. The roads are not even kept. unbelievable look at this if you were a woman a young woman would you feel safe walking around here Would you even feel safe eating at this Chick-fil-A? Scattered debris. Here we are, we're coming on Sunset Boulevard, the famous Sunset Boulevard. Let's see what we can find next. <laughs> like, bro, is this actually adding value to the economy? Or is this littering? I don't even know. Where am I going? I'm going to Hollywood Boulevard, not Sunset. Oh yeah, we're crossing over. We're just gonna keep this video going until my phone just runs out. Get a real feel of what's going on here in Hollywood.
take a look. Smells a piss. It smells really bad here. I swear women could get cornered on any one of these alleys. Look, while well, minimum wage is barely keeping up, it's a little higher here in Los Angeles to keep roofs over people's heads. If you take a look here, we have the robot deliverer. No more income for, for independent cron chargers that are interested in DoorDash. We now have robots for Uber Eats. Interesting touch to unlock. It's weird, man. Some people, there's a lot of this industries that will get outsourced and changed, but when it's too much, people will notice. Graffiti. This is the famous, world famous Hollywood. People suffering, man. Do you think those things are clean? I don't think so. As we get into the larger areas, the more uh, iconic areas of Hollywood, you'll notice that there's a very swift and very quick change from these sort of ragtag. These uh, sort of run downness. And you'll notice very quickly we've gone one block and already we have seen from trash, we're now seeing plants on the side. We're now seeing that those those scooters are now set up and propped really nicely. We, we have gone one block. No trash, no trash, plants. No homeless. Look, it's, we, we moved one block. It's, this looks like nice, this is the nice Hollywood that you think of, right? The floor's a little dirty, but like, look, there's plants, large buildings. This is the, yeah, see how quickly we went from that desecration into this privilege. Let's continue. already the streets are nicer no trash everything's nice and neat parking lots are good i don't know did we just cross a county line or something because it feels like a different city look you got nice marble etching
you now you got the art, so all the things to make it all amazing in the art. Take a look at this. You got the Hollywood Museum. And this is the busy part. This is the part that everyone sees. Why? Because look at it. It looks marvelous. It looks like the big city. But where did we just come from? We came from a place that looks so unfamiliar. It looks like the Skid Row. It's unbelievable. It's all a facade. It's all a mask. Let's take a closer look. A fire! Your streets in the middle of the night! The birds are dead! How many scenarios have you heard throughout time? Ways, interesting ways that people have died! But yet you ignore it! But you only have one chance! When you die, brother! I don't care if you are a father! When you are a father and you die, you leave your family to home! You leave them behind! But the question is, did you set them in the right way? And the right time? They only have one chance. They only have one opportunity. Did you think you can make peace with God? The gambling in the life of God is what I'm not. Shining with bright lights, this is Hollywood. We just came from a dirty, poverty-ridden neighborhood. We're like 400 feet from Hollywood. Now here we are. I want to know real. So I'm gonna die. Because if God is real, and he's been before me. Out of the 100.8 billion people that have died, what has God never heard that you can mess up in the nick of time? Explain the right to live. Right. Next we're heading on the subway. Let's see how things are going on the subway. I have some data points on that, but let's see what we see for ourselves before I go into that. Check out the subway and see how things have been. I've taken the subway many times over many years to see what's next. 